Hey, family from Aquarius in Mass by AC. Welcome back once again uh, to a new video. This is going to be the second part of a uh, semi permanent decoration for an uh, for you aquarium. Okay, so um, last time we did the background of the fish tank, and on this video, we're going to do uh, the caves or the ornaments that go uh, on the bottom. In this case, I'm gonna make some capes so um, they can be matched to the um, to the background that we did last time. All right, guys? So stay tuned because today is gonna be fun. All right, okie dokie. Okay, family. Um, now uh, we're ready to start doing the decoration for the inside. Remember, last uh, last video was about the background. Now we're gonna do the decoration that goes on the bottom of the fish tank. Now, uh, keep in mind the fish tank I'm doing is very small, so the decoration have to be um, kind of small of course if you're gonna do like 40 50 60 80 gallon fish tank decoration can be bigger you can use bigger rocks uh, and you know that depends what size uh, you're gonna do the, uh, your, the fish tank decoration is the uh, the size that you're gonna make the ornaments they go inside okay so we start with a uh, big one, well, it's very small, but for the fish tank, it's a big one. And why is going to be a big one? First, because um, by the time that you put this on the on the gravel, with uh, with the weight, if, if you put like very small rock as a base, it can go go. Um, burying itself with the weight into the gravel and will, will make um, unlevel and you don't want that so you want to keep it nice so that's why you start with a, a big rock okay and I say big rock because this is the size that we're gonna use to do the uh, the ornaments okay that's why I say big rock okay, what you're gonna do is you're gonna use silicone on the small ones see it, it, it's not really much what you put on it but enough and en uh, enough to keep the rock attached to the big rock and that's what you want okay so now you get another one and you do the same thing always put the silicone on the one that you're gonna attach to the one they're attached already to the uh, base that way you won't miss anything okay it's two You get another one. I know they look very small, but like I'm saying, fish tank I'm doing very small. So don't worry about that. And you just keep building all the way up. And you, depends how tall you want the, you want the caves. Um, that's how you're gonna do the uh, these parts, right? The so this is the support of the of the um, slave that is going to go on top. That like this one uh, is going to go like this. So depend how how high you want the big one, like the one is going to be the roof, is um, how tall you make these supports. Okay. So you get another one. 
Okay. Put this one. Okay, put in silicon. Okay, once that you put the one that is going to be very um, like the base, it's going to be big. You need to put another one when you're done, kind of big too, because the the more the more um, they stick to the one on top, it's going to be better. All right. So if you put a small, that's probably that's all they're gonna get. But if you get a big one, they're gonna stick more and they're gonna hold better the rocks, okay? That's why you, uh, you use a big one on top. Okay guys, um, so one that you done with these supports. You just let them dry and we'll see, okay? Let's put on the side. And I'll be back. Okay, family, something that was um, forgetting is if you want to put some plants on it, you can do it. You just need to cut. It has to be grass, okay? Because grass um, has the base that it will help you to uh, stick to the to the rocks really good now you're gonna have to cut it on this shape you see that's uh, um, the base of the plant that's how you're gonna cut it and then you're gonna get the silicone and put it on this extra long pieces of the base okay just like that. And then you're gonna look the way you want to see that this is gonna be my front of the plant. So I'm gonna put it right here, just like that. And then I get the other one and I do the same thing. Okay, just go like this. Okay, on the extra long parts of the base, a little bit of silicone. Okay, and then you can do it like on the other side of plant and just push it like that and that's how it's gonna stay all right you're gonna leave it like that and let it dry that's a little something that was um, forgetting and uh, it's a really a really nice touch on the on the supports all right guys be back Okay, family, and uh, we done doing the supports for the uh, caves that we're gonna make. And remember that we're working with what we got already, okay? This is some pieces, small pieces 
of uh, rocks that I have. So I didn't have to go and buy something or nothing. Uh, whatever you got there, uh, you will find the way to use it and you will be amazed how um, creat creative you can be when um, you have to be at home. So um, if you really like um, this hobby about aquarius, fishes, turtles and all that, um, you can use the imagination and like I always say, uh, the sky is the limit, okay guys? You put your own limits and uh, only you can decide until you uh, where where you can go or do. In this case, uh, we're doing this and uh, we have to wait because as you know, uh, every time that you use silicone, you're gonna have to wait a very long time to um, to get them dry and you know be safe to use them safe like uh, pick them up and don't just break everything so they need to stick really good so we can uh, start doing the caves into the fish tank and finish this amazing video they are really gonna like it okay guys so um be back in five four three two one <laughs> hey family welcome back um 24 hours have passed and we got everything ready for the decoration final decoration okay so um we make a double one. This is gonna be the one, the centerpiece. It's gonna be right here on the front and it's gonna to help to hold the whole thing. You will see. So now what you have to do first is put the big uh, supports in the back, which are the big ones, right in the corner, okay? That's how it will help to um, to hold the whole thing this is one of them and then the, the supports in the in the front okay you're just gonna put it like right here and then the other one which is right here it's gonna go right over here okay Okay, then when you have this ready, you're gonna put the centerpiece. You're gonna kinda uh, kind of uh, bury it a little bit, and then that's how it will looks. Then you're gonna put the pieces on top okay very careful you will go like this and then you will put the other one I think this, this one's a little bit this way and then like this okay and this is how it's gonna look as so you can see, uh, the hard part is to keep, uh, to make the pieces, the whole pieces with the glue and with the silicone and everything. But once that you're done, it's kind of easier to put the, uh, the decoration. So now we, what we're going to do is we're going to fill it up with water. All right, guys. And these ones will go like this. Okay. 
Okay. All right, yes. Let me finish and save that. Okay, guys, once they, um, we done uh, put the water on it, it looks kind of cloudy, but you got to understand, right? The, uh, the gravel and all that, the rocks. So um, I was going to put uh, another kind of filter. But I find this one, this is perfect for this, um, for this fish tank. Not too big, not too small. Yes, uh, perfect for the fish tank, okay? Now, we're going to put the fish that is going to go on this fish tank, okay, guys? Right, and we're going to connect the filter and also we're going to use this lamp okay guys something small but good Bottom. And it's almost good to go. So this is how it's going to end the final uh, of the semi-permanent decoration. So if you like this video, please give me a like, subscribe to my channel, share my videos. Tell your friends, your family, everybody about quality steam mass by AC. And the um, the most important thing, activate the bell because next time when I put another video into the channel, uh, you be wanna uh, you be notified and you be one of the first ones to watch. You can be one of the first ones to watch, so it's good, okay, guys. And um, nothing else to say but good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Until the next. Abur. That's how it looks. I will show you how it looks all turned up. Okay. Hey family. And this is how it looks after a few hours. You can tell the fish is more comfortable swimming all around. And it cleared up pretty good. Small filter. 
for a small fish net. Alright guys, thank you for watching.